We begin tonight with that breaking news. A young boy has died after being hit by a boat trailer at a popular Portland boat launch. This is Coin 6 News at 11. I'm Cole Miller in for Emily Burris. This all happened at around 6.30 tonight down at Willamette Park. Let's get right to our Jennifer Dowling. She has been on scene there all evening for us. And Jennifer, just a heartbreaking update to this story. It is. It's just a real big tragedy out here. It's supposed to be a fun day out on the water, and then something like this happens. It really is gut wrenching. Police have been investigating this all afternoon. Right now, a tow truck has come in to take away a black Land Rover that's been sitting here all day. Witnesses tell me it was the vehicle involved in this incident. There is a boat uh, attached to it with a trailer hitch, but police have yet to confirm uh, that that is the SUV involved. Now, Portland fire officials say that the child that died was just seven years old. He was hit by a boat uh, trailer and taken to the hospital with life threatening injuries. It, of course, was later announced that he died from those injuries. Now, police say the youngster was run over at the ramp itself. Witnesses said they heard a scream around the time of the accident. We talked to one man who frequents the area. He says the river and the ramps around here can be dangerous and busy this time of year. People have nearly hit my dog on these off ramps, nearly hit me on these off ramps. I've seen them hit, almost hit kids. You know, it seems like a lot of people don't take boat safety seriously. They think that, oh, well, this is a fun recreational activity. And yeah, it is, if done safely. And But what I'll say is I've seen the negative side of that where people aren't prepared and aren't ready. The area surrounding the boat ramp where this all happened has been closed for quite some time. Uh, police did keep one boat ramp uh, to the side clear so people could still uh, get their crafts out of the water as the investigation uh, went on into the evening. And both parties are cooperating according to police, but we haven't heard any word about whether some charges might be filed down the road. Police are asking any witnesses who might have seen what happened here, who they haven't talked to, to call them on their non-emergency line because they'd like to find out as many details as they can about what happened here this afternoon. Back to you, Cole.